sure have been quite a doll, Raggedy Ann. Yes, sir. Quite a doll. And I didn't even know you till I started making these trips up here to talk to you. And now I'm beginning to see more and more why my baby loved you so much. Why, sometimes, Raggedy Ann, I'd almost swear that you're just about as much alive as I am. Cause when I hold you up close to me, I can feel every ounce of the warm glow of love that she must have felt. And you know what, Raggedy Ann? I'd give anything that I own in this world if I knew just half the memories that have passed through those little black button eyes of yours and hid themselves in your tear-stained stuff. Bet you're just busting out with little old childhood secrets that could really set a lonely man's heart aglow. Sometimes I still have to laugh at the way you had to sample all of her food and see all of her little new dresses answer a thousand questions but you never seem to mind cause you always had that big old smile on your face now I bet that smile's dried more tears and cured more little old hurts than I could ever hope to kiss away it's really a small wonder you're all in one piece the way she used to drag you around by one leg everywhere she went. But you didn't seem to mind. Not one bit. And I want to thank you for giving me something to love when there was nothing left to love. And thank you for helping me raise her after her mama died. Somehow you stepped right into her mama's shoes and just that much farther into our hearts. And then that year of the rain, you remember? One night the fever took my baby and you laid right there beside her while I did everything I could, right up to the end. Since then, it's just been me and you, Raggedy like Ann. Just me and you. And the years haven't seemed to bother you too much. We're sure a little bit faded here and there from the wind and the rain. But that heartwarming charm and that spark of love seems stronger now than it ever did. And look at me. I barely made it up the hill today. Look, Raggedy Ann, I can't even brush the dirt from my knees. So don't look for me tomorrow. I might not make it. And I'd like to take you with me, but I know that you'd be happier right here beside my baby and keeping her warm. I gotta go now. I gotta leave you. And about the only thing that comes to my mind to say to you is, God bless you. And you sure have been quite a doll, Raggedy Ann. Yes, sir. Quite a doll.